What's going on guys, it's your boy Ozilex Gaming here and I'm bringing you a review on Sergio Dumbia. If you like these reviews, please hit the like button and if you like FIFA and you like my channel, please hit the subscribe, I upload weekly. So, let's get into the review. Sergio Dumbia, he has got amazing passing, amazing dribbling, amazing pace. He just uses that to a great advantage. I was getting so many goals in so many games with this guy. Doesn't show it, but because of EA's stupid glitch with the players, I did actually score more goals than I actually played with him. I think I was averaging about two goals per game. Anyway, the thing that lacks with Sergio Dumbia is his strength. He hasn't got the strength, but he makes it up with his four-star skills and his four-star weak foot. With them, he can easily just shoot around the keeper with any foot, any side, and his finesses are godly. They just go top right, top left every single time. They're actually amazing. Dumbia, for his price, I think he goes for about not even 5k. He's a cheap alternative to other Serie A strikers, and he's good because you can build a really cheap team and still have an amazing striker. He's one of my all-time favorite strikers to use. Just his pace and his dribbling make getting past defenders an ease. He just runs straight through defenders and when he's fully sprinting, no defender can catch him. Ababo and Jovinio also help because they give him assists over the top through balls, through balls and just passes and Dumbia can do the rest. He doesn't have a lot of strength, which makes it very easy for defenders to push him off the ball, but using his pace, he does get past them quite a bit, which means the defenders cannot catch up to him, which is usually an open goal. He can also go to the side really quickly and just score it into the empty net, which is one of the things I love about Doombia. His finishing is also amazing. It doesn't feel like 75, which what it says in the stats, it feels more like 80 to 90. He almost finishes everything inside the penalty box, and pretty much everything outside the penalty box as well. His long shots aren't that good, but if it's just outside the penalty box, he's almost guaranteed to score every goal. You'll see in these clips that Dumbia takes on three, four, five defenders at once, and he can do that with his four-star skills and his dribbling. Also, his agility and balance are all really good stats to have in a striker. I personally think that Dumbia is one of the most OP players in FIFA 15, you'll see on these clips how good he is to get past defenders and bury it in the back of the net. All his adats make up for a really, really good striker. He scored me so many goals, and I guarantee that if you put him in your Serie A squad, or a hybrid squad, or whatever squad you want to build, he will score you lots and lots of goals. He's got to be one of the best strikers in the Serie A league. Ababo last year was good, Dumbia this year, I reckon, is better. He is just so OP. It's actually insane. I did try Dumbia with two strikers, but it didn't work. Only because Dumbia was always getting caught offside, or there was always another striker that was making better runs than he was. So as a lone striker, he stands out more as a player, and it's easier for him to beat defenders and score those easy goals. He does have the dribbler and the speed star specialty, which I think are exactly right. Juvenio, Dumbia, Ababo. I think that is the sweatiest team this year, guys. What do you guys think? Is that the sweatiest team? Do you hate coming up against that team? Because you know Dumbia, Juvenio, Ababo will just wreck you. So obviously his pros are going to be pace, dribbling, his four-star skills, his four-star weak foot, and his shot power all make Dumbia the striker that he is. His cons are his strength, his heading, and his long shots. Even without strength, he's still an amazing striker. So for these reasons, I'm going to give Doombia an 8.5 out of 10.